Hey, what's going on tech fans? Elric at Tech of Tomorrow with Nick from ASUS and we got a lot of really killer stuff to show you guys at this year's CES 2014, including some concept stuff that may not come to market, but ASUS wants you to know that it's very possible. So with that said, let's hand the microphone over to Nick and let's hear what ASUS has at this year's CES. So Nick, right here behind us, we have a concept thing, right? Yeah, so this is more of a concept demonstration that we're showing. We have a Z87 Deluxe Quad Board, which has two Thunderbolt 2 ports on the back of the board. And here we're taking two of our radar uh, PCI Express uh, SSD cards. We're basically rating them together over Thunderbolt and then Thunderbolting it back to the motherboard itself. And what are like the fastest speeds you guys have actually seen on this thus far? So this demo that we're showing here is getting, you can see over a thousand megabytes a second. Um, in read and write is getting up a little bit under a thousand. So that means so, you could transfer your, your, your games and everything very quickly, yeah. right? Uh, on, in a snap. So this is something that will be possible. Um, maybe we'll see some vendors implement some, some external hard drives in this fashion. Um, there's a lot possible with Thunderbolt 2. So how very, I mean, even though right now this is a concept, how very feasible is it that this can actually hit the market though as a product if someone wants to jump on it and grasp it? I think all the tools are there, so it's just a matter of uh, someone thinking that the market's out there and making it, right? Right on. Well, you guys out there, if you're a manufacturer or something, you guys see these guys have a new concept item here, which is faster than fast. Now, I know there'll be some stuff coming out with NGFF technology that may be a bit faster, but for those looking for this type of technology, it's going to be breaking the barrier. And then staying on the Thunderbolt 2 end, if we shift over here to the next product, we have a Thunderbolt 2. PCI Express card, so. It's even in a nice glass cabinet to show how beautiful it is. So some, some of you may have seen the first one that we had shown before that uh, was not in, did not end up being certified, did not end up being sold. This one has already been certified. It will be compatible with a list of ASUS motherboards that you'll be able to pull up soon. Right on. Um, so that means you guys are gonna be able to actually get this product, right? Yes, and you'll be able to add Thunderbolt 2 functionality to your existing ASUS board. Um, and this will come late February, not early March. Concept. Yeah, so this is awesome stuff. I mean, when this hits the market, I think a lot of people are going to jump on this. Everybody's always looking for the fast of the fast. And with Thunderbolt flexibility, I think everybody's gonna be jumping on it. So what else we got here? I see we got stuff running all the way down the table. This is, this is another thing that you will see in the future. You will not necessarily see on this board. Here we're showing off SATA Express functionality. So we have SATA Express implemented. Um, you, might be, you might be seeing Springy? some demos using this. Um, you see the SATA Express ports here in the bottom right corner. Um, this we expect to see on future chipset series motherboards. But can I get it with like a little man on the end here so I can put it in my computer case and have a little flop around like a little, like, little funny head on my dashboard? You gotta let people know where the SATA Express is. All right, okay. God dog it. Yeah. All right then. And over here I see you guys have your latest motherboard for the AMD platform. Yep, so the new, the new AMD CPUs are gonna be coming out soon. This is our A88X Dash Pro. And this one's actually currently selling, right? Yes. All right. So folks, let's, if you guys are interested in this motherboard, for you folks out there who love the red and black and are loving the ASUS, well, here you go. All right, folks. So those were just a few of the things we have here at the ASUS booth. Stay tuned because we got a lot of things happening with video cards, including the Poseidon. So stay tuned.